Hey guys, what's up? Tyler here. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the Manfrotto Pixie and the Manfrotto Pixie Evo 2. Two tripods that are pretty similar, but I think it's worth owning both. So first, we're going to be taking a look at the Manfrotto Pixie. This is the smaller of the two, and it is $25. And in my opinion, this tripod works best for vlogging. Um, its arms, or its legs, I suppose, extend out to the angles such as this. And then it has a ball head that swivels when you press in this button and then you can move it around like so it does not go to a 90 degree rotation only a 45 degrees so if you need something that goes to 90 degrees this one be it and so up here at the top we have our thread we can thread it onto a camera this tripod can hold 2.2 pounds um, i wouldn't recommend doing anything over than that uh, just because this ball head is just held to, in place by this button and if you press it that's what loosens it up. And if you would have too heavy of a payload, it's just going to start working against the ball head. And if I really tried, I can actually move this. So if it'd be heavy enough, it's going to fall over time and lean over. Um, but the nice thing about this and why I think it works so great as a vlog, uh, vlogging tripod is that it fits really good in your hand. It's ergonomic in your hand. These little grooves right here fit nicely around your fingers. Um, and the nice ability to just rotate this as you need is really nice as well. Um, it's small, it's compact. And it doesn't take up a lot of room. And so now for the Pixie Evo 2, this is a little bit fancier of a tripod. It runs around $36 on Amazon. It does have extendable legs that lock into different positions in case you're on some type of uneven surface. The Normally the legs go out to this angle, as you can see, and I'll show some other shots that give you a little bit better idea. And then you can actually hit this little slider right here to change the max angle to pretty much flat and this is going to give you a really nice sturdy tripod um, for either on the ground or on a table. And this ball head actually can rotate to 90 degrees. It's a little bit different. This one you don't push. You actually turn this one to loosen it up. And then this one can go to 90 degrees. So if you need a ball head that goes 90 degrees, the Evo 2 would be the one you'd want. And then tighten it up, twist it. There you go. Uh, the nice thing about this one is as a rotating thread, you don't have to rotate the whole tripod. You just rotate this thread here. And so the max weight capacity for this tripod is five and a half pounds. And honestly, I got this for my Canon C100. Uh, I did the math, the C100 plus my Sigma lens is a little less, it's like 5.2 pounds or something like that. Um, not five and a half, 5.2. With my mic and everything, it might be around five and a half. Um, and I did try it and it didn't fall over or lean over or anything, but I would be very cautious if you're at the max payload or a little bit over. Uh, but for something like a T3i with a kit lens or even a little bit longer of a lens, um, it's going to be fine. These two tripods, I think, are just so different that it's worth owning both, um, especially if you're into different types of videography. If you're just a vlogger and you just have a point-and-shoot camera like this, like the G7X or Sony RX100 or something like that, maybe the just regular Pixie Evo is all you need. Um, you don't need the extra features. You don't need a rotating 90 degree ball head or the extendable legs. This will work just fine for you. But if you need some fancier shots, the ability to get down to the, uh, the ground closer or like really flat along a table or a heavier payload, I'd go with the Pixie Evo 2. Um, but like I said, I would recommend both of them just because they're both good to have. And in all honesty, I was going to buy both of these and I was going to return one because I figured I didn't need them both but they're both different enough that I think I'm gonna keep both of them around. It is worth noting that both of these tripods can be bought with different adapters. There's one for a GoPro, there's a little clamp for a cell phone. Um, just depends what configuration you want, they're all available on Amazon. That's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit that thumbs up button and let me know if you own either the Manfrotto Pixie or the Pixie Evo 2 down in the comment section below and what you think about them. Really good tabletop tripods, would definitely recommend. Links will be down in the description below. And that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Check out all my social links. They're all down in the description below. And we'll see you guys in the next video.